Hi guys, this is Vidas and welcome to another training for today. Uh, in this video I will uh, teach you about the harmonization of uh, the ascension hymn tune uh, called uh, Look the sight is glorious, also known as uh, Brin Calfaria, set to the tune. Alright, uh, let me first uh, uh, s look at the registration. I'm using uh, Hapsburg sample set from Piotr Grabowski, Alessandria, Mascioni organ. And uh, let me now uh, play the, uh, the first stanza, first verse once through, and then we'll talk about each course, chord. Okay, let's now take a look at each chord. I will analyze each chord, uh, cadences, maybe some some specific uh, modulations if there are any. We'll see. Okay, I will show you the keyboards, and I will play on the second manual with the principal stuff only. So we are on the key. Of G minor, this is tonic chord, tonic six chord, dominant, tonic, dominant, tonic, tonic six chord, subdominant, dominant, then tonic. Again, repeated verse, tonic, tonic six chord, dominant. Tonic, again tonic, dominant, tonic, tonic six chord, subdominant, dominant and tonic. Tonic, dominant six, tonic, subdominant, dominant, tonic. Now this is short tonicization of the key of B flat major excursion to the third scale the E chord. So this is dominant of B flat major. Tonic of B flat major. Tonic. And going back to G minor. Subdominant six, subdominant seventh chord. Sequence, right? Subdominant six, and uh, seventh scale degree chord. Third scale degree chord. Sixth scale degree chord. Second scale degree chord. Second scale degree six chord. chord, subdominant, dominant, and tonic. Very simple. Maybe I can I could also talk about the cadences if you want. Okay, each line has its cadence here. So the first cadence, let's take a look at at the keyboard view. Mm -hmm. 
So here, subdominant, dominant, tonic. This is compound cadence. It has subdominant, dominant, and tonic, all three functions. Um, but it's only half cadence in the in the middle of the piece in terms of the of the form. Same is the next cadence, right? But this cadence um, can also mean it's a, a compound perfect cadence, right? Or not, or imperfect. Let's see, dominant. I think it's imperfect because even though two last chords are not inversions, that's good for perfect cadence, uh, then tonic ends on the first scale degree, which is good, G in soprano, and then the third um, rule is actually broken. Tonic should be on the stronger beat than the dominant. Dominant is on the first, down, on the downbeat, and tonic is on the second beat in the triple meter. So it's actually imperfect compound cadence. Okay. Next, uh, let's see the cadence. Uh, let's see. Maybe it will be. Dominant cadence, authentic uh, half cadence, right? Let's see. Uh, not here. Here. So, subdominant chord. It's not a, a total. Subdominant, but the subdominant function. Second scale degree six chord and the dominant. So, which means it's an um, authentic half cadence because it ends on the dominant, on the dominant uh, chord. And the final ca uh, cadence, the final, final cadence is, is interesting. Like at the beginning, probably. Imperfect compound cadence. Or not. Oh, actually, tonic is on the downbeat, so it's a perfect cadence then. A little bit different from the beginning. First two cadences. Let me play this uh, hymn one last time uh, with a louder registration. Okay, let's check. Let's add a, a fifth and a s two feet in the manual. Maybe let's do with the ripieno and 16 feet in the manual too. All right, no tuba, contrabasso, okay, like this. And uh, Contra Fagotto 16, that would be enough, probably. Let's see. The la one last time, I will show you entire view. There we go.
I hope you enjoyed my harmonic analysis of this hymn, hymn tune Brin Calparia, uh, set to the text of Look, the sight is glorious, uh, suitable for ascension, which is coming up shor shortly. So, thanks so much for watching. Uh, if you want to play this hymn, just analyze like I do, uh, follow my example, and you will be able to know how the piece is put together. All right. Thanks, guys. This was with us. And I'll catch you online in the next video very soon. Bye-bye.